Cats and TV. Hey everybody, Cats and TV, and today we are exploring the plates from Mutable Instruments. The plats is really 16 oscillators in one, arranged into two banks of eight, green and red, which you can access through these two buttons. It's a powerful instrument and was used extensively in our episode 99 video. Now each of the models has three degrees of freedom that map to different parameters in each model, but they can all be accessed through the harmony, morph, and timbre knobs. It also has external input for pitch and gate, which we have attached to our trusty Arturia Mini Brute 2. For this demo, we're gonna focus on bank two, the red bank. It has more of the noisy and inharmonic models that I tend to find more interesting. The first model is a granular cloud of eight envelope sawtooth waves. We can change the amount of pitch randomization as well as the grain size and grain frequency to get different percussive and less percussive effects. Okay, this next one is white noise passed through one of three different filter types. Ooh, I like this next one. It's particle noise, and it is dust sent through a variety of bandpass and all-pass filters. There's just a lot of percussive sonic variety in this one. The next two models form a sort of mini rings module inside the plats. First up is a classic inharmonic plex string model with controls for tension and length. I've always enjoyed working with the string models. Next up is a classic modal synthesizer, which is great for pitched percussion. The last three in the bank are drum machine models, but they have a lot more degrees of freedom than you would traditionally get. First up is the kick drum. Okay, now let's move to the snare. And finally to the hi-hat.
Okay, now we are actually going to check out the final element of Bank A, which is a voice and speech model with a variety of different programs for phonemes, letters, and even some words. Okay, we're going to try to dial it into something that's actually intelligible here. Now, one of the really powerful things you can do with this module is switch among different models using an external CV. In this case, we're going to actually hook it up to the Make Noise Maths that's conveniently next to it over here. we can also attach it to a sequencer, in this case the Make Noise Renee, which is also controlling pitch and trigger in addition to the model selection. There is still a lot more functionality in this module. If you would like to see us demonstrate any more of the features, please leave a comment below. Thanks for watching! Check out more at www.catsynth.com and please subscribe to CatSynth TV. You are watching CatSynth TV.